Already gone. Anyway. Okay. So I'm going to take this number, this number five French feeding tube. Oh, <laughs> right side up. Um, out of the package, it comes with this little tag on it, mm -hmm. which is actually a stopper. Mm -hmm. I'm just going to take the stopper off. I'm going to insert that in into this bottle of what happens to be formula, but you can use either formula or expressed breast milk. Mm -hmm. And then, now I make this look really easy, so you're going to have to do that way, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, so then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this tube because it has two little holes in it towards the end there. I hold it about two inches, two and a half inches from the end, mm -hmm. and I push against the breast and I insert. Whoops! And she said no. Okay, because mm -hmm. I'm video. Because don't make a don't make a fool out of me. Okay, so then. I know, I know, sweetie, come on. And see how the melt, you can tell when it's working because the milk starts so moving right away. Okay. And then see how deep her lash is? Mm -hmm. Look at how hard she's pulling right there. Um, that's because she knows she's getting milk. Yeah, because it's, it's, it's... Even though it's coming from a different source, she doesn't know that. But she's just pulling harder because it's just a little bit easier. And mm -hmm. she's taking a pause and now she's going to go again. So this is one way of supplementing at the breast. Mm -hmm. You still get the lots of breast stimulation. Your baby gets plenty of food. Mm -hmm. And oftentimes this will correct the latch or it will help um, heal up the, uh, the phrenotomy because the baby is using her tongue properly. Mm -hmm. Now... I am going to show you the upper lip is flared properly right now. Mm -hmm. And the lower lip, I don't want to mess with her too much. Oh, don't get cranky. Oh, don't get cranky. So now she's off. Okay, then when she goes back on, now mm -hmm. I make this look really easy and it takes practice. Mm -hmm. I had to learn how to do it. Mm -hmm. And so it's easier to have somebody else kind of slip. Shove it in there. And you want to do it towards the back of her mouth, not across. I think I just went across her mouth. So, so you're coming from under the... So what I'm say doing... back of the mouth. I'm trying to figure out where that... Look at me. What I'm doing is I'm pushing it back that way. Okay. Okay? Okay. So I, with this finger, I push... Whoops. I push against the breast, and with that one, I push into the mouth, and let's see if it starts. See, and here comes the mouth. Oh, oh there you go, sweetie. There you go. I know I have milk all over your face. Mm. Oh. Doesn't seem to be there. That sounds like she's better. Oh, no. Now, if you have somebody to help you, it just makes it a lot <laughs> easier. Sure. And just remember that I had to learn this. And a lot of people say to me, oh, there's no way. That doesn't work. It doesn't work. But if you practice, it'll work. And it's it's a great way to... Um, she's taking a little break. Let's see what she does. And she's actually been feeding for a while already, so... There you go, sweetie. That's a good girl. Oh, okay. I think she's getting kind of full. So, or the other thing that you can do. 